Okay, so we're recording, Luke. Why don't you tell me what we're working on? Okay, and what is our test? To see how much weight it takes for the hovercraft to move the farthest. The farthest? I thought, I thought we were checking to see if our propulsion is going to work or not. Yeah, you said that we were putting weight on it to see how far it would go. Right, we're going to... What are you pulling on there? Okay. And what's the rope hook to? It's hooked to a pulley up there, isn't it? Let's see if we can see that pulley. So, the rope is hooked to a pulley. It's on a crane. We've got a loop in the rope. And then, the rope goes down. And that's hooked to another pulley. It's on the ground there, right? Yeah. And that's hooked. To, that's got some weights on it so that that pulley doesn't move. Uh -huh. And then the other end of the rope. What's that hooked to? This end. No, not your end. The other end. Oh. Way down there. Now let's see if we can move our out a little bit. Way down there is the hovercraft, right? Yeah. So what should happen is when we turn on the hovercraft and hook some weights up to that rope you're hanging on, it should pull the hovercraft. And we're going to see what condition requires the least amount of resistance and what are we going to do first? Well we're going to do it without what without the nozzles on right and then we'll take the tape off the nozzles and we'll do it again and it should take less weight to move the hovercraft right? That means the propulsion nozzles are working. So let's go down and take a look at the back of the hovercraft since we made a change to it. Okay? Okay, so what changes have you made? Um, we changed the nozzles so it's a smaller hole and it's now facing the, the top piece is angled to the ground so the air is hitting the ground. <coughs> right. We made the the old nozzles, how wide were they? Go down there and show me. How wide were they? Right, so we taped them off until we found out what? <coughs> the smaller the hole, the air, the air, it wasn't inflated on the bottom so it wouldn't hover. So we had to change, make the nozzles smaller so it could, it would hover. Uh, the bottom would inflate and hover, and the, it would still get pulled. Okay. So that's the size of nozzle that we decided is going to be the best for right now for test? Yeah. All right. So should we set up and run our first test? Yeah. Okay. There's a look down the other end there. There's our setup. There's our weight down there, and that goes up to the crane. There's the little loop in the line that we'll hook our weight onto that should pull everything. So let's see what we get. Okay, here we go. Nozzles blanked off. Ten pounds. Thanks. 
movement. Almost. Give it a little gas. Give it some gas. Yeah, give it some gas. Okay, buddy. Power. 